guys, Adam here from Darts Reviews TV in association with Darts Planet TV. Got it right again. Uh, so today, Target have sent us a set of the Dynamite Keen Barry Darts. So, let's go and open the box. Dynamite! I couldn't think of anything funny, so I'll just shout, Dynamite! Right then guys, here we go. Here's a closer look at the Keen Barry Dynamite Generation 1 Darts. So these are the first set of the keen buried darts i wonder how much these will be worth in a few years time for all those collectors because uh, this guy he can throw darts can he he's a great player so the first look at the box nice packaging nice logo very similar to a lot of the target stuff we've seen nice little image of uh keen down the side there a image of the dart in the middle and then dynamite written down there nice little lime green color mixed in with the browns and blacks these are 22 gram steel tip 90 percent tungsten dart and as i said Generation one just mentioned there. Um, we flip the box over, and again, a nice little image of Keane, uh, an image of the dart, the flight, and just telling us what's in the box. So, instead of telling us what's in the box, let's open the box and have a look. So, we've got a little flap there with some target stuff just fell out. Right, plonk that there. Okay, so the dart themselves, they come in this white felt packaging, hold them all in place, all set up and ready to go. So we'll take one out and have a closer look. Pop this to one side. So we've got the intermediate pro grip shafts in there and as I said, the dynamite target flights. Um, the barrel itself, so, it's very much like a traditional barrel that we're really used to seeing with the straight barreled ringed grip, but there's a few twists in here that's given us an extra bit of grip. As I said at the start, it's only a 90% tungsten dart, which for me, perfect. But it's got this real intricate pixel grip all the way along the barrel, apart from this little spacer in the middle where they've just stuck in the target symbol. Um, there's a combination of both axial and radial precision milled cuts, and this is for a bi-directional grip. The length on the dart is 54 mil and the width is 6.2 mil, and then it's finished off with this really nice black titanium nitride coating, which gives it that extra bit of durable finish. Um, the dart itself, I quite like these. I think I'll be able to throw these well. Um, it's a fairly short point in there, so we'll see how we get on with that. But they're already put together. Let's go and have a throw. All right, there, guys, here we go. Time for a quick nine or 12 with the Keen Barry Dynamite darts. Let's see if we can get some good scores. One hundred and forty. Good start, Adam. Bounce out, but a nice 80. That first dart went low there. Always hinders me. One hundred. One more handful of these. And then we'll go and have a quick summary. Oh, what an end. 45. Right, guys, we're going to have a summary on those. Hey right, guys, a quick summary on the Keen Barry darts. Uh, pixel grip dart, which is uh, really popular at the minute and really good. Weird little comment now. So I found them a little tiny bit off putting because of the pixel grip. When I threw them, because we got the ring light, uh, the lights really shined on the little dots on the dart and made it really bright. So I was looking as I'm throwing the first dart to go in, I got like these lots of little white dots where the dart is. Um, some people might like that. I don't know. I just found it a little odd. Um, the price, $82.95. So for a Generation 1 dart, uh, his first set of darts that we're going to be buying, it's quite the high-end price. But there is, I think that's because they're the pixel darts, because the Rob Cross ones were, the pixels were quite high as well, weren't they? But bearing in mind, these are the same price as the new Taylors and the new Barneys. Maybe a little bit high on the price, but... Really nice dart, really well made, loads of detail gone into the dart. Um, and I think a lot of people have been talking about these and quite interested in these. So hopefully there'll be a few going out there right now. Grip rating wise, let's give it a good solid 3.5. Uh, really good grip on that. Um, all in all, quite a nice little dart. I mean, I threw them okay. Would I buy a set to play with? Most probably not, not quite for me. 
but doesn't mean they're not for you. That's the whole point of this reviews thing. Um, no one's got the right answer. One set of darts might suit someone, one set of darts might suit someone else. Someone, I mean, I throw a set of darts that people hate, but I throw them all right sometimes. So guys, please, 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 if you've got a set of these already, and you want to leave your review, you can do that at www.dancereviews.tv or even better, don't worry about doing all that. Just download the app on the App Store or the Google Play Store and you can leave your review on there. And you can carry me around as an app. How cool is that? Turn your notifications on, subscribe to the channel and I'll see you again soon. Cheers, guys.